Three deaths later, and we finally killed her. Welcome back to the Seven Stand User. I'm your host, Cars on Mars, with famous YouTuber and um, uh, struggling t um, Team Fortress 2 salesman, Thomas Awesome 55 Please buy his stuff. Yes, I need. Please buy my strange quick cloak. It's only 75 cents at the community market right now. I Wait. need it so I can go buy some. A shirt for the soldier, please. Yep. She fucking dead. Oh man. Oh dude, look at that. We are knocking on heaven's door with this amount of HP. You see that? Oh my god. But cars, is she dead? Is she dead? She is deader than dead. I hate that. <laughs> you know, since I've accidentally poisoned Iggy during that last run, um, I'm gonna like um uh, heal her. I mean, I heal. I'm gonna heal uh, him. I'm sorry. What? I get my. I get my genders confused. If you can excuse me. Did you just assume his gender? I really. Hurt. I have a headache from that fight. Ow. That fight was like a major headache. Alright, so let me just let's check the friendship point stuff on Iggy real quick. That's what I was gonna do. Six, not that bad. Let's depart. Let's get the hell out of here. And so we continue to Luxor by boat. The people in this village are all descendants of tomb robbers. Rumor has it beneath these houses there are treasure troves that the government doesn't know about, and thieves want to keep it that way. Uh, Mr. Oh, Paul? Sorry. Eh, pull it up. You really think there are still undiscovered tombs? It is a possibility. By the way, where's Gramps? He went to the bathroom. Iggy's with him, so he should be fine. The bathroom? Do you need to go too? Uh, if it's anything like the toilets I remember. Are you ready? Good. Oh! My! God! Well, come on, do it correctly the way I know you want to do it. Oh my god! You call this a toilet? It's just a shallow hole on the ground. <clears throat> the air is dry so the poop turns a dozen and blows away quickly. A wind toilet? Oh my god! Is this a tub of sand to wash basin? I'm supposed to wash my hands with sand? Oh my god! I may not be as bad as Polnareff, but I'll just hold it till I get to the hotel. What's the point of building a toilet like this? You might as well just go behind a rock. Egypt sure is weird. Uh huh? Ha ha ha! What's this power outlet doing here? See, that's cl that's so clearly stand. a stand. He's like, I'm gonna fucking touch it. Oh, touch it. It's attached to a boulder for some reason. What are you supposed to use it for? It can't possibly have electricity. He was shocked. It, 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 it. Ow! It shocked me a little. Man, that hurts. I fell on my touch. Ugh. I didn't expect it to actually have an electrical current. Is there a cable underground? I don't get this country. This is surreal. Mr. Joestar, what are you doing? We're leaving soon. Oh, got it. Be right there. All right, so for this character, just sound, just sound smug and annoyed at the same time, all right? Ah, uh, my tits. You know exactly what this part is, don't you? Boys, all right. Boys always want to touch things they're not supposed to. Oh. I love how you refer to Mariah as tits. What's wrong, Mr. Joestar? Well, my prosthetic hand is acting up. I just got it from the Speedwagon Foundation, too. Maybe the joints need oiling up? So yeah, judging from that, what do you think, um, uh... Yeah, Stan did something to her. But, uh... Judging this, this this scene right here, um, keep an eye out and take a wild guess as to what the stance ability is from that electric shock. 
Hey, turn the radio off, will ya? It's just playing static, so I even have it on. That's weird. It's Japanese made and I just bought it. Well, the sand's also able to trap with the currents, so it's probably messing with the radio right now. It's electromagnetism. Yeah, it's magnetism. Yep. Huh? The bottle cap from the soda stuck to my hand. That's Mr. Uh, go Kate Polnareff. Thanks for explaining that. Oh, fuck it. Oh, I, I swear. It's up, Is all everything right. all right? I'm fine. We still have two days to go before we reach Cairo. We're all a little bit beat up. Why don't we stop in Luxor for the night and take a load off? Yeah, let's do it. Ever since we reached Egypt, the enemies have gotten way stronger. It's been tooth and nail fighting them off. I agree. If the enemy catches us when we're exhausted, then we're done for. Yaddy yaddy does it. Well, I suppose we'll better be prepared to enter Cairo that way. Still, don't get too complacent. Let's just find a hotel. Hey, the radios start working again. They have magnets on them or something? Ah, they're gone. It's in great shape. You, you beat this guy. Cool. One, two. The carver's hammering nails into the table while holding the extra nails in his mouth. Uh, one, two. Uh, uh huh. That's odd. The hammer is getting heavier. All right, remember magnetism. Uh, what's going on? The nail is vibrating. The nails in the carpenter's mouth are pulled in and pierce his cheek. He dropped his hammer. When I, saw I don't know why I'm saying that. Yeah, I think it's I think it's bugged. But um, let me tell you this right here. When I saw that the first time in the manga, I'm like, oh, it's magnetism. I wonder how bad this could be. And I saw that, I was like, ah. <laughs> why are you doing this, man? Ah. <laughs> Adol caught the hammer just about to hit strike Joseph's head. Uh, nails. The nails. It hurts. Nails. Wait. Did you hit your finger with that hammer or something? You should be more careful. Your hammer almost hit us. <laughs> Sponge Bob me boy! Sping Bob me boy! Sping boy me Bob! The next morning. The next morning. Oh fuck, you I just remembered. What? Alright. Time to get up, Mr. Joe Star. Polnareff is whining about breakfast. Just get him out of bed, Abdul. Jeez. Aren't other people supposed to wake up early? Tell him to come down in five minutes. Damn it! What a loud mouth. Tell him I'll be right down. <laughs> My watch has stopped. Will do. <laughs> but Mr. Joestar, you sure are a restless sleeper for your age. You turned around 180 degrees. You fell asleep facing south and now you're facing north. Guess you're young at heart. Or maybe it's just the magnetism, you know? Yeah. No, 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 This is strange. Somehow I've been not feeling off since yesterday evening. My prosthetic's in bad shape, too. Huh? Oh, the chair must have metal in it. The chair is sliding towards me. Huh? What's with this chair? It's sliding around on its own. Is my hotel room tilted? They're charging me 200 bucks a night per person. They must have skipped down out building it. Uh oh, you see those two people right there? Oh, uh, they're gonna When Joseph passed the young girl in the hall, her skirt suddenly flipped up. Now those are young women right there. What is that over there in the back? Uh, an older woman? You're damn right it is. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, it's good that you already said that already. Eee! What are you doing, you dirty old codger? Uh-huh, what? The girl punched Joseph in the face. Eee! 
Ugh. What's going on? But what did I do? Uh oh. When the old one walked by, her skirt flipped up as well. Uh. Oh goodness me! What an aggressive way to show your love! Hee hee! You're just my kind of guy! <laughs> now, let's both of us say this, alright? I think we all know what's <clears throat> gonna we're gonna be saying here. Give you ready? Give me back and take a drink. Me too. <sighs> alright, because there's no cause I gotta I gotta at least do one, you know? I can't have you take all yep. the fun. Let's go. Oh wait. Mwah. Something's definitely off. I know something was going on since yesterday evening. The forks and knives are flying at Joseph. What? They're... They're sticking to me. Everything metal is attracted to me. Maybe my body... Ah, oh, my body! It's become a magnet! Oof. Ow, that smarts! <laughs> I think you meant that it hurts. <laughs> that's... That's smarts. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Is this magnetism being caused by the new stand user? Probably shouldn't have touched that power outlet yesterday, Mr. Joestar. Mr. Joestar. So, why can't I see the stand? Ah! Could it be, I, be because I touched that outlet in the rock yesterday? Is that shock the cause? Uh, I've got to warn Joe to an Abdul. Fuck yeah, we're saving the game. This this is gonna be nothing but cutscenes, by the way. Until the very yeah, end. Must be around here somewhere. Huh? Yeah, I probably should have stood on the escalator. Ah oh, fuck! Uh, now I've done it. The steps are made of steel, and the magnetism's effect is getting stronger over time. See, that's kind of sucks, doesn't it? Yeah. I'm gonna get crushed by something big eventually, you know. Jingle, jingle, jingle. Huh. Chains of luminous skirt wrapped around Joseph's neck. What? And the chains being caught in the escalator. Eee, that's gonna, that, that's gonna cause some problems, wouldn't you agree? Yeah. Say goodbye to your neck. Ah! Hey, you! And the micro mini! It's an emergency! I've caught in your skirt chains! Press the stop button on the escalator! Chains wrapped around his ankles. So yeah, it's supposed to tell. Yeah. Uh, hey, are you listening? <laughs> huh? What? She's got AirPods in. <laughs> in 1989? She's, got, she's listening to her Walkman. Oh shit! Be a stand. She's listening to her Walkman. She can't hear me. Oh no. <laughs> Relax, just a Joe Star. Are, are you the stand user? The chains tighten around Jotaro's arms. Oh no, he became a classical fallen dude. Oh no. Once you're caught in my Bastet's magnetic curse, there's no escape. Ah! Someone! Anyone! Stop the escalator! I know! I'll press the stop button with my Hermit Purple! No way! There isn't one? There's no emergency stop button! How can this be? Abdul pressed the button. Yeah! My neck! My neck! Ah! I'm at the bottom! It's over! Ah! I'm dead! <laughs> uh, <clears throat> Hello, Mr. Joestar. My neck is snapped! Ahem. It's broken. Oh. I've already stopped the escalator. The button is like right next to it. Ahem. Excellent. This top one is in perfect working order. This elevator passes inspection. Oh my, look at the time. Are you the social manager? Could you sign here, please? Uh, what just happened, Mr. Joe Star? It's the enemy. 
I've been caught in an enemy stance trap right now. <coughs> My body is a magnet. Can I take a drink, please? Metals have been flying at me all day. Uh, plus, the effect's getting more powerful by the minute. Oh, she was, she was out there off screen. It's her. She's the user. Huh? I'm going after her. We need to get rid of this magnetic effect before I become mobilized. I'll go get Jotaro and the others. We don't have time for that. She's getting away. I need to go at, le at least get a good look at her face. Oh. And uh, maybe something else. She went to the woman's restroom. How do we proceed? I'll go in. This is a matter of life and death. I have to catch her. Mr. Joe Star, as you tell, Avdol really doesn't want to be in here. Shh. Shh. Which which stall is she in? She got really shapely legs. Look at the legs and see which woman has the nicest pair. You, you want me to sneak a peek? It's an emergency. I'll make sure she doesn't escape from the top of the stall. Jeez, uh, no, that's not them. M Mr. Joestar, over here. I think I found them. Are these her legs? Uh oh. You heard those jingling, didn't you? You heard that jingle, didn't you? T tell me you heard that jingle. Yep. Oh, oh, oh man. So I bet you forgot that bathroom blocks are also made of metal. Oh no. Oh. Joseph Magnus didn't force the stall doors open. Oh, oh no. Oh Jesus. Oh no. It's all the young girls and the old lady from before. Oh no. Oh my. That handsome man That's from before. You followed me all the way here! How forward of you! Ah, holy holy shit. shit! Oh! Holy I shit! Woman oh. Again. But she was on the second floor! Why does this keep happening to me? It's the wrong person! This isn't gonna be good! Let's make a break for it! E and die! What a man! Ah, uh, this isn't my style. Bathroom disasters are pulled reps department. Did you just say something hey, about that? what did you say? <laughs> What'd you say about my bathroom disasters? I'll have you know that I only get ambushed while I'm in the toilet. I don't ambush other girls while they're in the toilet. <laughs> you see that, Abdul? I'm better than you. Okay, God sure. God damn it. Where is she? She's right there. She's over there. <laughs> Damn it! How could she get over there? Come on, after her. Uh, Abdo, I forgot to tell you earlier. Don't you touch anything that looks like a power outlet, no matter where it is. That's the enemy stand. If it shocks you, and you'll become magnetic. I've already touched it, Mr. Joe Star. So I wonder what. So when do you think Abdul touched it? When they were running out. No, when he hit the uh, the stop button. Uh. What? When? Remember when I pressed the emergency stop button on the escalator? There was an outlet right next to it. It shocked me. Woman! Look, Mr. Joestar, please separate yourself from me. You're making it very hard to run. So they're, they're kind of like squished together. Yeah. It's pretty oh, that's never he said the fucking blowjob. That's where the blowjob came from. I love you trying to describe JoJo scenes that you barely remember. It's funny as shit. That's where the blowjob came from. And, and the, the glorious hump. You remember that? It's like, yeah. we got on so much with Joestar. Oh, 
This is Abdul who's junk that made contact with Mr. Joestar. So we gotta shut up. You are the one to separate, Abdul! But you came over here! It must be the magnetism sticking us together! Uh, it's just some enemy. She, she's tough! They're, yeah, they're stuck together. <coughs> oh, fuck. <coughs> You've done the wrong fight. I can't believe <coughs> this! My body is also turning into a magnet! No! I can't believe it! Calm down, Abdul. We can't do anything about it now. We have to think of a way to beat this stand. Where is that damn woman? Where's that damn fourth chaos emerald? Ah, uh, I don't see her anywhere. Ugh. I've got metal all over my body. Oh, two dead people. Look, two different dead sprites. All right, stand up slowly, Abdul. All right, we're up. We've got to try separating. Two magnets stuck together equals twice the magnetism. Let's just try to make it to that fence. Oh, we can use it to get ourselves I love stuck. You. I love you, really. It makes positions. Uh. Onward, Abdul. By your lead, Mr. Joestar. One, two, one, two, one, one. two, one, two, one, two. What are they doing? Uh, Mr. Joestar, this is quite embarrassing. Hey, what are you looking at? We're practicing our dance routine. Bug off. It, it's nice to dance in the street. All right. One, two, and three. Nice. We made it this far without tumbling over. So it seems. Abdul, you move your body a little bit? Yes, a little. Good. I'll grab onto this fence while you slide your body down bit by bit. Once you get to my feet, we can separate. My head is stuck to your head, then your head and my feet just deflect each other. See, makes sense. That is some pulls. R right. Hmm. Yeah. Just like that. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, this this part's rife with comedy. Uh, I have achieved comedy. What's wrong, Abdul? It, it's just this position. If someone to see us, there might be a big misunderstanding. No, oh my no God! At us. Just keep going. They brought all their friends! Hey, go away! There's uh, nothing to see here! Stare. Hey! I told you to scram! So scram! You little brass! Come on! Faster, Abdul! Hurry, get off of me! I'm trying! Uh oh. Oh, oh dear. Oh, you you get the voice for that one. This definitely isn't my department either. from before I followed you here thinking you were my Mr. Right to think you had this kind of interest it's like he's Mr. Wrong now huh Fucking. you had some nerve playing with a woman's nerves like that you cheating bastard yeah okay ah ha ha faster faster Abdul I'm gonna cry. <laughs> I love the shot in the panel fist. It's just Joseph looking so sad and he's saying to Abdul, like, Abdul, please hurry, I think I'm gonna cry. You cut out. Like, Abdul, please hurry, I think I'm gonna cry. You must uh, uh. Ah, help, help me! me. Oh, oh my, my god! god. Find they separate and roll down the side of the hill. We did it! Oh, cuz you for generations! Go to hell, you clueless jerk! Alright, so <laughs> we're gonna yeah, stop right. Bisexuality. 
we'll stop right here, alright? So we'll have this continue on for the next part. Yeah, sounds good. Ah!